Hey y'all, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Binky Bianca with some more blog talk. And today we're going to be talking about Kevin Samuels. So I saw that earlier Hollywood Unlocked had actually posted a story about Kevin Samuels 911 call. They were able to post the audio from the 911 call, which was placed by the woman that was with Kevin when he became unresponsive. Uh, TMZ actually had obtained the audio in Hollywood Unlocked was able to repost it, so take a listen. Okay, is this the house or apartment? Oh my god, I don't fucking know. You don't know if it's the house or apartment? Oh, it's an apartment. Okay, what's the apartment number? I, I know. I just need to give him CPR. Just please, just ask the person. You need an ambulance? Yes. Okay. Are you listening? Hold on, ma'am. I have to connect you with the ambulance. It's Kevin fucking Samuel. I please. understand, but I have to connect you with the ambulance. Are you okay? Yeah, man. What's the address of your friend? Is he awake? No, he has an irregular rhythm. I can feel it. He's he's breathing in and out, but he has an irregular rhythm. It's probably his heart. So I need you to get here with the fucking. Uh, <laughs> and then, man, I'm up. Stop him, man. Come on, Kevin. You got it. Oh, come on, just try to breathe. Come on, you got it. Come on, think about your mom. Think about your daughter. Let's go. One, two, three, four. One, I'm sorry. two, three, four. I need to call the front desk to get an AED. He's not going to make it. One, two, three, four. One. But man, I don't want you to disconnect because something can happen while you disconnect now. I understand, but I'm saying I need AED. I need, if they have one downstairs, I need to get them up here now. Are you able so to get I, the I, neighbor, ma'am? I'm going to get up with the neighbor. Hang up with you, or you call them in the front desk and give me a fucking AED right here now. He's turning blue. I cannot wait any longer. Okay, and there you have it. So as you heard, the young lady that was with him sounded very frantic trying to get him some help. She was freaking out, and you know the 911 operator. They, she didn't sound too urgent, the first one that, that picked up the call, but with 911 operators, I guess we do need to understand that they have to be calm and they have to get the information because you could hear her asking her, is it a house or an apartment? Because that that's important. If it's a house, okay, cool. Then there's going to probably be some more questions to go along with that. How many interests, whatever. But since it's an apartment, we need to know exactly what apartment number. Apartment buildings have hundreds of units in them. So we need to know exactly where you are so we can get help to you as soon as possible. But you know, the young lady, of course, she, she's freaking out. She's not expecting this. And I, from what I believe was reported before, you know, he kind of passed out and fell on her. So she was all of this is just coming out of nowhere and she's probably was doing the best that she could under the circumstances to try and and get him some help trying to keep him alert you could hear her trying to you know wake him up make him you know just talk to his consciousness as much as she could but unfortunately it just did not pan out and unfortunately they were not able to save him but anyway um it's still very sad to me that a person lost their life so suddenly like that no matter what kind of person they were, I don't wish death on anyone and I feel for his family and hopefully they can find some peace in this whole situation and there'll be more to come out, but hopefully this will help to clear up the young lady's name as well because her full name is out there and people are talking about her as if she set him up and that she hurt him. But when you're listening to this call, it sounds like she was trying to help him and she really was genuine in her in her efforts so let me know what you think uh let me know what you think in the comments below and i'll talk to y'all soon